Hey, I found a quarter. Nice. Look at that. I actually found a quarter in behind someone's um, blue like truck. Underneath like well above some rocks and I'm actually shocked that I actually found a quarter. Uh, that should go on April Fool's uh, day, so to speak. Or at least maybe a good April Fool's luck, so to speak. And we got some cactuses where I live. Well, okay, well we do live in the desert. So I I don't know what to say. I found a quarter. Okay, that's not that's not um easy to come by because I normally will find pennies and I think dimes, sometimes nickels. Kind of weird how find dimes for the nickels. But yeah, um, like Dion, you got lucky today. And you know what? You should you should feel part of it and deserve it. So, I mean, I feel like I stole in the quarter. Like how basically in that um, Spongebob episode when Patrick and Spongebob feel guilty that they stole it in a balloon, which they basically um, thought they borrowed. But it was just a balloon because it's not so free balloon day. So besides that, and I also got plus to go with me, that will leave me my afternoon today. Um, he doesn't have his face mask on, if you can ever tell, right? And I'm wearing braces. Hey, and I just had to wear my one piece. I got honked! Why not? Why truck over there? <laughs> What on earth? I needed that today. I'm not sure who this man were, but oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not. I'm trying to get like, okay, it's been a long time since I've been like out and about, and I get like really nervous when people hug at me. That's a good thing. Where I'm from, because basically they either see me walking a lot, they love my outfit, or they may have seen my stuff on social media, probably. So I, I just had to say, but it was I do live in my state, or is from Phoenix and if you just see me walking around do not take a personal if I don't say anything back I just get really shy so I needed that today honestly because like Dion you've been through a lot and he deserved support from other people so those men I definitely couldn't think more than enough and yeah um I gotta clean these braces up because they're filthy so um because I am like a little bit out of breath because the thing is when it comes to living in Arizona during the summertime, I do love the heat. It's just that when I'm actually out in public, my anxiety goes up, which doesn't go well with the heat, which means basically your your body works harder, which is just more likely to be dehydrated. Um, sorry, I just uh oh, gotta fix my shirt. Um, I, I'm actually just walking towards uh, GameStop to see if they got anything for me to um, buy, give or take. And it's so awesome to see people out here that are Muslim. Because I was seeing um, another woman. She actually was fully covered, like how the women at, in Afghanistan, they cannot show their faces. Because um, I'm thinking in both Afghanistan and Saudi Arabia, before I get back to the topic, are really strict with the Islamic law. So this means women cannot like show their faces outside the house. And honestly, it takes a lot of courage for women to go through that. Especially since we had, um, what is it, Women's Month last month? So I just wanted to share that as a little fun fact. And basically, I'm here in Phoenix, right? Today, today's high. I just, I just wanted to take a little break. Well, found a penny. I swear. Okay, I'll, I need to I need to talk about our um, state theory shortly. Um, I want to take a break um, from uploading reactions because I just did a reaction as well as subscribers today as an April Fool's special, and I had to be upload my Hero Academia later because soon it got blocked. Um, that would have to be a push this head later on. The thing is, out here in Phoenix, today's high is 93 degrees, and this is like the first day of April, right? Now, like, I'm gonna explain this. So, I this um, I, when I get, like I said again, when I get a lot of social anxiety, I, my body tends to work harder. That's why I'm like more pooped out. The thing is, we get this hot starting this month, usually it's not this early, not till like at least mid April. From basically this point to May, June, July, August, September. Basically, half the year, like almost half the year, probably like 40 like maybe two percent of the year we actually get this hot here and basically we average a lot of the nagis towards like the hundreds and i'm thinking an average like 30 days maybe between 23 to 32 days on average 
we get like temperatures of 110 or more. It gets really dangerous out here, which is why, um, how do I explain this? Basically, heat exhaustion is really common here where I live, along with basically, how am I gonna say this? People dying of the heat, if they actually go hiking, you, you gotta go hiking in the morning. You cannot go hiking in the afternoon. Unless you love the heat like I do, then more power to you. But the thing is, is that it can get really dangerous here to the point your kidneys would fail, like mine. I still got a video of me when I went to the hospital after being dehydrated to see, how am I gonna say this? Um, a cute guy that I like, that was 19 at the time. I was, let's see, how old? I'm 26 right now. I was like 23 when this happened. And I walked all the way from Phoenix, which is where we live, all the way to Deer Valley, which is like 10 miles, just to actually see him. And it was so embarrassing because he basically didn't really, he, I guess he felt like weird, which doesn't make sense because I literally told him I could actually go meet him. I know this is crazy that I had to walk 10 miles for a guy that I chat with for like a week that I don't even know just to spend time with him. Plus, what's to say that he does my little yoga kink? I'm not talking about sex, okay? Like, that's just something that I'm into. And then, next thing you know, he actually felt awkward after, well, he called 911 so that I could go to the hospital, the Arrowhead Hospital, which is the better hospital than the incident that happened from my electric reaction. And he basically just had to block me. And I just think you're like, why would you do that? I actually sacrificed my life just to meet you, just to be friends with you, and you had to treat me like scum. It doesn't make sense. So I just wanted to share that, which is why it's really dangerous um, where I live during the summer months, or at least beginning of April, because if you're not used to the heat, like I said, you could die here. It's like living in your cuts. Basically, the quarter city, well, it's actually the quarter's biggest city in Russia. Um, they actually have temperatures for like what three months on average like the whole season that's below 40 below but no 40 below zero with this ice fog it's really dangerous up there so yeah um i just wanted to share that as a little fun fact and you know this is what i'm usually used to so besides that i want to go to gamestop you know they probably have a lot of things that have been um how would i say this um, probably bought already because if you actually seen that video that I posted um, yesterday, the thing is, is that they're getting rid of all the merchandise. And I did not get my Deku socks because I wanted to get it. Because see that I'm a huge My Hero Academia fan. I think someone probably bought the last pair. So I'm gonna show you what game stuff looks like a day later. And Fred, my earphones are like all over the place. Hold on. And basically, um, for this game that they're supposed to close uh, by, I think, near the end of April. Unless, because I'm sure a lot of things are gone now. Um, they might close probably like the end of the month. So, like I said again, this is like my favorite game set that I go to while I'm actually here. And let's see how many people are in here. That's not many people. So, other than that, I'm just going to give y'all like a little tour of actually here. And I do got water on me because it's, like I said again, pretty hot out here. And, oh, you can't be this is so cute. They got Jugaboo Z Chibis. Oh, those are adorable. And they actually got, um, what's his name? From My Hero Academia. That's supposed to be, I forget his name. It's supposed to be, um, Genist. What's it supposed to be? The guy that actually has, I'm not sure what his quirk is, to be honest. And you actually, yes, they do have them. Ugh, awesome. They still got my, uh, my Deku socks. I'm gonna pay for them today. Cause honestly, considering that, I cannot get the Super Mario 3D All-Stars like I mentioned yesterday. Um, I just had to skip it and just buy it online. Cause they do have it on eBay. But like I said again, I mean, I had to check later on today. They don't have, they don't have any more copies at Walmart or at this game stuff alone. And, well, I actually buy the one here because it's actually 20% off. I gotta drink some water. Honestly, I, I, it's been a long time since it's been this hot. Because uh, my bunny needs to get adapted to the heat uh, well, for like the, the next couple of weeks again. Because I like I like it how it gets hot here. It just, it just it takes a while. Um, speaking of Rick and Morty, because I know Season 5 poster coming out. They got, um, are you kidding me? They, they, they got the Plumless Moonlight. Basically from the episode when Jerry had to go to the hospital. And of course they got that giant, um, 
Planet Rick from the Guest with the episode. It's, it's pretty decent. I don't like it that much, unfortunately, but I do like Rick and Morty regardless. And I still got the little Pringles um, in my uh, drawer. The Rick and Morty Paper Rick Pringles and the Rick and Morty uh, Mr. Meeseeks um, Pringles. So, Casina, I do have to go with me. I'm not wearing my... I'm not, I am actually wearing my, my Hero Academia t-shirt. Um, over my One Piece t-shirt, I'm gonna get these socks because these are the last pair and I had to get them because, well, I want to actually have to add in my collection. And, um, they also have Naruto Shippuden. And usually, usually these are not, these are not cheap, by the way. Um, because, like I said again, these are actually 20% off. So, basically, um, this, this will cost, um, well, it's $40. But since it is 20% off, I'm guessing you may get like five dollars off, so it'll be $35, unless I'm not doing the math right. Um, let's see, half of 40 is 20. So, um, that's like, yeah, that's like five dollars off. And you also got um, Cowboy Bebop. I forgot to share this this whole time while I was actually here. Because seeing that Cowboy Bebop is actually being in the trending again, especially after there's stuff airing out of those families to watch when I was a kid. And they also got, um, What's his name? I need to get I need to get this T-shirt later before they're out. This is supposed to be um Ing Ain. I cannot pronounce his name. He's adorable. Unfortunately though, well for me this is not a problem because I'm really short. The only got small and medium, and this is what the small size looks like on me. If I could actually just um share this while I'm actually here, it's actually wow. It's a Almost as long as my One Piece t-shirt, if you can see that. So, yeah, they're really getting rid of, of this stuff because it's really saddening that they're actually closing this place down. That's why I had to, I had to sit on Facebook. And I'm like sweating like crazy. So, I don't know, I just want to share this once more while I'm here because like by the end of May, you're not gonna see this um, game stuff anymore. And that's why I'm actually here in the first place. So, I don't know, I'm actually gonna wait in line so that I can actually pay for these Deku socks. And I'm gonna go to Walmart if they still have the Super Mario 3D All Stars um, um, copies. Because, you know, yesterday was the last day that they're selling that game because Nintendo, they actually want everyone to buy. You know, the, the Super Mario game because of the 35th anniversary, which is kind of selfish in their end because a lot of people won't be able to get it. And with the Pikachu thing that I actually have, um, plushy, part of me, that I actually filmed yesterday, someone already bought it, so it's not there in the shop anymore. But they do have, um, Farfetch, also. So you got the original Farfetch, and you got, um, Halloween Pikachu, which is really cute. So, I just had to just do, like, a little video while I'm actually here. And by the time I get back, the Spongebob April Fool's reaction should be done by then. And I might upload the first episode of Season 5 of My Hero Academia. You know, already reacted to it because I got copyright. So, I just wanted to share a little bit while I'm actually here. And then I go get, get back at the house and watch um, Chucky. Because it's supposed to be a marathon today for April Fool's Day. <sighs> but yeah. It's a shame that I actually could close this place down. Oh, and one thing I need to share, they also got Star Wars, um, figures. So they got Princess Leia, they got the, um, I forgot those, um, space, um, soldiers, and they got Luke Skywalker himself, along with Han Solo, AT Driver, I guess that's the name of them, and you also got Lando as well. I'm, my mom loves Star Wars, if I could get that to her as a birthday present or a Mother's Day present, I would. I'm not sure how much it is, though. They're not, oh, they're not that bad, I'm like for $20. Is this place still here by Mother's Day? I'm gonna get my mom one of those. You know, she doesn't really play extra figures, but I just want to share that. Hello. Oh, I actually want to buy these um, Deku socks. Oh, I can move my earphones. What's that? Oh, I actually don't. <laughs> 6 dollars okay. Cause this was, this was, I know, um, when you're actually at GameStop, you also had to pay tax as well, so I just had to get these deck of stuff before they're gone. <sighs> I like your Spider-Man sweater. 
Um, by the way, I'm wearing all my socks today and plus ultra. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, may I have a bag? Uh, do you want a bag for the sock? Oh, yes, please. Um, is the game a corner for the, um, for the, if you actually have the pro membership? Yeah, you have the pro membership to get the magazine. Oh, um, how much is the pro membership? Uh, if you want to get the physical magazine, it's $20 for you. $20? Oh, okay. Hey, thank you. No you too. <laughs> I'm going to miss this place. Oh, praise when Dan Lee's outside. But I don't know, play for Fun to see some music. Da, 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 da. So I had to get these Decker socks. And I'll be probably posting them on Facebook and Instagram because, sorry, I'm celebrating because my stupid braces. Um, the thing is that this is the last pair, you know, I can, put, I can get it on eBay, but I had to pay like $12 for it. And I just don't mind paying $7 because they don't have the small 3D All-Stars. So I just had to get that. And this is probably like one of the best videos that I'll be uploading at least this year. And this is what they look like. I have to wear them later on when I'm wearing my outfit. So once again, with Plus Tech Q, because I'm actually almost out of storage, and the socks. Plus Ultra. <laughs> this would be 